What's going on guys, Klepto here, and welcome back to the Crooked Man. Now, I've been wanting to come back to this game for like a bit, but I've been very busy recently, and I don't think this game is a good streaming game, so I, if I'm wrong, let me know in the comments. But anyways, let's hop right in. Alright, last time we left off, we pushed the Crooked Man down the hole, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I think so. Right, let me just get that off the screen, okay. Right. So I don't know what the objective is. Um, Sissy ran away, right? Or just left. Now that the crooked man is gone. He fell down one floor, so he should be behind her somewhere. Are we looking for the body or what? There's just anything we can do. Okay. I don't like the ambient noises in this game. It's kind of creepy. Right. Nothing. Keyhole. Do you have any keys? Um, we got a brass key. Wait, we got cigarettes? Oh shit, dude. We might need that. Not gonna lie. This is the bar. We've already been in here, there's nothing. Keyhole, locked, okay. What are we supposed to use a brass key for? Hmm. Okay. So, we should try to find a utility room so that we could get... Was it, like, wire cutters? Wasn't this door, like, blocked with wires or something? Or am I tripping? I might be tripping. I don't know. Um, hmm. What about this blue door over here? This was locked with a code, yeah. I don't know the code. Um, yeah. Let's cancel that. We have no idea what the code could be unless... Wait, let's go into the staff room. There might be a code. Um, wouldn't surprise me if there was. Okay. 106 needs fixing. Okay. Wait, what? Door in room 106. All right, let's let's head over there. Let's see what we can find in room 106. Is that on this floor? Yeah. Hold on. This is 101. So this is 106. Okay. So the door. Don't I have a doorknob? I don't. I thought I picked one up. That was probably for something else, though. Okay. But where did the crooked man, like, fall, is my question. He fell down a floor, but, like... To what floor? I'm saying, like, the basement? So, wait. We did find something in here, but... I'm gonna have to take a look here. One... Two, four, five. Let's try that. Didn't work. Let's try eight. What if we try 1258? Damn, I'm stupid. Okay, chapter one. Okay. Search for Mr. Hyde. Nothing. But why does it skip chapter three? Is there not a third chapter? It skips chapter three. Um, goes on to five. It skips six and seven. Is the code going to be the missing chapters? Three, six, seven, nine. Let's try that. I doubt that's going to work, but we got to try, bro. And I'm going to feel so smart. Three, six, seven, nine. That was incorrect. Oh, it was right. Okay. Bat, bat, bat. You see something shining, but it's out of reach. Okay. Let's take the ladder. Use it. Yes. Let's use that. Good idea. Good idea. Got the key to 209. Okay. So this game's going to be all about keys. Take the knife, bro. Okay, I guess not. 
Now we know there's a weapon here, though. So if you do want to, you know, start shanking, then we can shank. That'd be nice. All right, 209. That's on the right side, right? Yeah, it's on the right side. Should be on the second floor right side. Yeah, last room. This is 209. Yep. Let's go. Okay. We got some broken glass. Burnt. Okay, something was burnt. Was this a photo? There's something under the pieces. A scrap from a notebook. Okay. I can't read that. I don't need her memory anymore because I know she won't come back. I have to erase everything, good and bad. And all the memories inside of me too. Okay. My head hurts. Oh, that's such a creepy sound. I don't like that. Ew, it's easing up. Sheesh, I'm exhausted. Guess I haven't slept much. So he burnt this photo to mend his broken heart, huh? I know I couldn't do that. I'll never forget. Never. According to Paul, that makes me a pansy. Oh, shit. Sissy. Oh, there you are, David. Did you find the box? No, I can't find it. There are lots of rooms I can't get into, so it might be in one of those. What's wrong, David? You look kind of pale. Oh, it's nothing. But sis, you should really leave soon. Why? You may not believe me, but there's some kind of bizarre monster around. I found it in, in the basement. I was attacked by it earlier. You'd definitely be in danger too, so I think you should go. Look, I don't like the dark, scary places either, but there's no need to tease me like that. I'm not a kid afraid of the boogeyman, okay? Alright. Sorry, but I'm not trying to tease you. I'm telling the truth. Don't worry, I'm not mad. You don't seem like a dishonest guy, so I'd like to believe you, but a monster? Maybe you mistook something in the dark. You could be susceptible to seeing things when you wander around in the dark like this. I'd like to think you're right. Alright, if you insist. But be careful, okay? I know. Well, I'll go looking elsewhere. Just leave, please. Creep me out. Okay. Now, let's search this room. Shelves are empty. There's just nothing in here, except for that photo. Head on. Where do we go now? Oh, what the fuck was that, bro? What? Alright, there's some red text on here. Red writing. What's this, was this here before? No. Is that in ketchup? Leave me alone. Please leave me alone. Come to me. I'm waiting for you. Oh, shit. Sounds pretty inconsistent. Who could have written this? A ghost. Don't start, bro. No, I don't I don't know what to do, bro. So bad. Oh, fuck me. Why? I dropped you down a pit. What the fuck do I do, bro? I gotta do something. Oh, uh, alcohol. This monster doesn't give up. How about some of this? What? Am I gonna hit him? Hell yeah. <laughs> Beat his ass. I guess I won't do much alone. What else can I do? Hit him again, bro. Hit him again. Alright, so how's your day been? Empty beer bottles. So let me think about this. What the fuck do I do here? Um... If I run, he's gonna zoom out at me again. I guarantee it. So I hit him with a bottle. What do I have in my inventory? Lighter. Fuck's that gonna do? Cigarette. Wait. Lighter might be the play. If he's got alcohol on him, this is this might be the play. Does it work? Oh yeah. Now that he's covered in alcohol, he should be plenty flammable. Let's go. So is he? Let's go. I'm better than you. He ran away. What the hell is that thing? Why is it chasing me? 
How did it survive before? I might need something to defend myself. Even just a knife could really help. Was there one of those around? Well, yes, there was. You just didn't take it because you're, you're a dumbass. Let's go get the uh, knife. God damn, I don't like this. It's like 7 in the morning. I'm scared shitless. Let's get the knife. Okay. Um, yeah. Take it for self-defense. Yeah. Um, might be a good idea. And we got blood. This wasn't here earlier. Did something happen to Sissy? No way. Not my girl. Follow the blood. He went upstairs. No, she did not. He went on the red carpet, that's why. And the trail leads to... This door. The door is unlocked. Um... Is he? You good? You alright? What are you doing here? Whoa, your arm's bleeding. So it was your blood. Were you hurt? There's, that's a lot of blood, bro. My arm caught on something. It's not that big of a deal. Don't worry about it. It's bleeding a lot, though. And you've been resting here, right? What if you get anemia? I'm just a little tired. I've been walking around a lot. Really, don't worry about it. Okay. Give me your hand, sissy. Uh, I have a handkerchief, so I can at least try to wrap it up. Wait, she's actually kind of pretty. What the? Wait. How old is she? Hold on, chat. <laughs> Wait, why did I say chat? I'm not live. God damn it. Uh, I guess this is better than nothing. Doesn't doesn't hurt? It's fine. Thank you. You're so kind, David. Call <laughs> me Klepto. You don't seem so well. Did something happen? Oh, it's nothing. I've just been so silly. Silly? It's so that I'm wandering this dark place all alone, falling in holes, cutting my arm, all to find some measly box. Measly? But it's important, right? A memento from your boyfriend? Well, he's my ex, to be exact. Well, then, it's silly. Come on, now. Why would you hold on to the past? Just move. He left me quite a while ago, but while we were dating, this hotel was our special place. Oh, shit, there's music? That was when I lost the box. I've been worried about it ever since, but I only just worked up the courage to come look. I thought I could forget everything about him, but it was no good. Coming here just brought back all these memories. Why did you break up? I don't know. Maybe that's why I won't give up. He said he appreciated my kindness, but when we broke up, he said it was all I had. He was exactly right, so I could- Wait! That's exactly what David's uh, girl said. Isn't that what he? Isn't that what she said on the phone, or not the not the phone? But I really am a wimp. No wonder he'd break up with me. Even I'd hate a girl like me. Wait, David, this is your chance. This is your chance right here. Sorry, I know I'm just annoying you. I'll rest here a while longer. I'm a little dizzy. Thanks for your help, David. On here, I found this. I'm not sure where it goes, though. Received a key to somewhere. Oh, my days. <laughs> no shit. Thanks. Don't strain yourself, okay? Alright, so we got a key. Well, I'm going. We got a key to somewhere. Thanks. Thanks a lot. That's, uh... What? Why are you always like this, David? Like, what? You're always such a yes man. Just going with the flow. Do you even have a personality? Oh shit, who said that? I don't mean to. I mean, I try to think for myself. I don't see it that way. You're not kind, you're just indecisive. You'd treat anyone else the same way, right? That's why I can't trust you. Who the fuck is this? Look, please just listen, I'm always thinking of you. If I'm a pain, then I'm sorry. There you go again, thinking you can just apologize and everything will be fine. You don't understand a word I'm saying. Then what should I do? You just don't trust me, is that it? Maybe it's hopeless for us. Oh, is this his girl? 
I hate for it to end this way, but I think we would both be worse off staying together any longer. Thanks for everything, David. Goodbye. Wait, we can talk this out, surely. That's a nice name, too. God damn. Kindness is all you have. Lucy and I are the same like that, timidly refusing to forget. The moment I realized she didn't love me, I felt like I was nothing but worthless. I wonder if Sissy felt that way too. Hey, band together. Hook up. Okay, let's find out where this key... Maybe it says in the description of where it goes. Where's the key? Somewhere key. Received from Sissy, a key used somewhere unknown. Yeah, okay, bro. Let's find out where it goes. What the f... Alright, not in here. Not there. Maybe it goes to the back room here. Yes, let's go. Right, we're outside? Okay. Let's get the uh, shiny thing. Something's in the fountain. A box. Maybe this is the one Sissy lost. Why the fuck would the box be out here, though? It's kind of sus, bro. Come on, though. It's kind of sus. It must be. It's decorated with rubies. Did someone throw it away here or what? Man, I'm glad I found it. I'll get this to Sissy pronto. Got Sissy's box. Okay, bad. Let's go. Sissy. I got your thing. Hello. And she's gone. Oh, did Sissy leave already? But she's wounded. Yeah, I can't. Sissy? Early? I'm coming. Don't worry about it. I'm coming. Beat that man's ass. Where's the crooked man? Where? Where's the screaming? Where's it coming from? Where are you at? Oh, shit. Sissy? I told you it was a monster. No, stay away. Oh shit. Stop right there. Back off, monster. David. Ugh. Damn it. Did you get out of the hotel? I got this. What are you? I said run. I'll take care of it. Bang. Hey, monster. I don't know what the hell you are, but don't you dare lay a finger on Sissy. She my girl. Oh shit. Uh, let's save. Yeah, sure. Alright, let's beat his ass. Oh fuck! Oh shit. Alright. <laughs> Listen up, little monster. I'll beat your ass. Come here. Come here. Oh. Yup. Come here. What's up? What's wrong? Why are you so slow, huh? Oh shit. Come here. Yup. Oh, fuck. Come here. Shit. Come on, then. Oh, shit. Fuck. I'm better than you. Oh, shit. Wait, did it? Did I get him? I got him. Let's go. I got him. Uncrooked man. Defeat the crooked man without taking any damage. Let's go. David. David! Are you okay? Hell yeah. Yeah, I don't think he'll chase us anymore. But never mind me. Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm not hurt. Ah, we did it. We did it. But... What happened? Sissy, what's wrong? Are you not feeling well? Why did this happen? Why did I have to go through this? Why did that horrible monster attack me? I just didn't want to forget him. I just wanted to have my memory of him, at least. Is it because I'm such a wimp? Is that why this happened? Can I- can I not even love him? Damn, this is getting deep. No, I hate it. Someone. Somebody help. Let's see. Oh shit. Please don't cry. 
What's wrong with being a wimp? I get I get the option? I mean, what do I even pick here, bro? Does this even matter? Can I pick whatever? I kind of want to pick what's wrong with being a, vimp, a wimp. You know what I'm saying? I kind of want to do it. I think I'm going to have to do it, bro. Please don't cry. It's like... Well, I'm, all I know is if I heard that in, in a situation where I lost my, my girl, I'd kind of be pissed. It's like, <laughs> just let me cry, bro. At least let me do that. But it's like, at the same time, if you had a significant other and they left you because all you have is kindness, you can find better people, for sure. So they're not worth crying over, but still, it's nice to cry sometimes, man. Let's just do the second option. I hope it doesn't matter in the end. What's wrong with being a wimp? Huh? Oh shit, <laughs> I fucked up. You may feel like a sissy. You're not being able to forget him. But is that such a bad thing? David? You know, I was dumped a few months ago too. Oh, I was sure we were going to get married. You too? I was dejected. Even now, it still pains me. I don't think I can truly forget it. I've always hated how I was such a coward. I'm a miserable excuse for a man. Especially in romance. I couldn't even be happy when my friend got married, and it made me hate myself even more. But looking at you, I've come to think... Oh, kiss, kiss, kiss. Maybe it's not bad to keep thinking of someone. In fact, maybe it's a wonderful thing. I decided I wouldn't give up either, and it's thanks to you, sissy. Thank you. David. This is your treasure, right? It's a pretty fancy box. It'd be a shame to throw it away. Take good care of it, okay? I'm sure the one you love will understand, and I know I'll always support you. Thank you, David. I... I'll try a little harder. I hope things go well for you, too. I bet. Hey, David, did the box come with a key? A key? No, I didn't see one. Strange. The box needs a key to open, so I thought... So, though I didn't lock it, a key. Wait, hold on. Maybe this brass key. No, of course not. Wait, how would that even... Yeah, that's the one. Where'd you find it? Uh, what, really? Uh, I picked it up around here. That's cap. Isn't that the key that we got from the start of the game? A key from my house opens Sissy's box. So, the former tenants involved with the box? What does that mean? Does that mean that he was Sissy's lover? Ooh. I wonder why it was locked. Let's open it. Oh, there's a piece of paper. That's... Sissy, can I look at that? I thought so. It matches with the notebook pages, which means he... I don't get it, but I guess the guy you're looking for put this paper in here. Seems that way. It has an address on it. Are you going there, David? Yeah, he wasn't here, so I'll check there next. Okay, be careful. Yup, see you in a bit. I'll escort you home, sissy. It's dark out after all. It'll be alright. Thanks, though, David. Well... Damn, not even a fucking... Oh. Ooh. I'm really thankful, David. Let's see each other again sometime. See, this is what I'm talking about. I deserve that much. That surprised me. So she's not going to give me her number. Okay. She seems happier now. That's good. I feel a little more relaxed myself. Lingering scent of dreams. And is this an address? Maybe that's where he is now. I'll go check it out. I've come this far. Until I find them, I'll go anywhere. Scene 1, Hotel Ruenheim, Sissy. End. Oh. 
All right, next place. This place was far. That took almost an entire day. What is this? Is this like a hospital? So this is the place. Looks like the school was abandoned. Okay, it's a school. Cool, cool, cool. No one around, though I guess they'd be inside anyway. Let's see if I can even enter. So why is there abandoned schools and hotels? Like, why are they not demolished and made into something new? Or being used for something? That's my question. Like, where is this? United States? Has to be, right? Okay, I can move. Um, I think I'm going to end this episode off here. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like so that I know that you like it. Subscribe if you're new to the channel as I'm on my way to 2k subs. And uh, yeah, as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.